Hey guys, I'm sitting in my recliner chair here at the UK Chandler Medical Center Hospital. And oh, there's my view. <laughs> there's my little keyboard. So I could watch you guys on the big two. Um, I figured out how to do it, sweet Leanne. I had you playing all night, watching. Uh, you and my eyes were awake and watching you get your hours. And I had um, sweet Julie on for a little bit for her birthday. Um, yeah, got to uh, win some things. That was lots of fun. I am hoping to be out of here in a little bit. I'm so excited. This is my happy face. This is the mask that I've had on in here for days. Yeah, it definitely needs to go home and... and have a rest <laughs> so do I um, there's nothing more crazy than being sound asleep and they wake you up to give you something to help you rest <laughs> have you ever had that happen <laughs> honey we've got a little something for pain and to help you rest let's I want you to wake up and take take this. <laughs> yeah, I have found this little lovely can of Seagram's Diet Ginger Ale. It is caffeine free, but today, I mean. I'm celebrating. I get to, I get to get out of here. Um, I know a lot of people were thinking, "Girl, what do you have, Crohn's?" Yeah, I have Crohn's, not COVID. <laughs> you know, I meant to say COVID first, right? <laughs> yeah, that's what I was going to say first. But here we are. I've had my breakfast, and I've had. Um, I might stick a little picture of my breakfast in there somewhere. It was pretty good. They came and asked me what I wanted last evening, and I told them. So I did order a Southwestern um, Southwestern omelet. <laughs> it was good. Um, sitting here in this beautiful sunlight. I can see all my crinkles and wrinkles, y'all. But you also see my happy face. <laughs> um, I'm all so close to being pain-free today. It is a good feeling <laughs> to sit up. Mm, I did get a very strange crick in my neck um, yesterday sometime through the night um, I have my trusty little neck pillow Nani Mae you know what I mean these things are amazing yeah I bought it for flying and yeah, I've used it a few times for that. But I literally sleep with this every night because it helps me um, to rest and helps with my um, breathing. So, how crazy. <laughs> I have to sleep with the little elevation anyway because of the nasty drainage. Uh, but to be able to sit up in this chair physical therapy and occupational therapy came in and I said 
I got this, guys. Thanks for your help. They were precious. They said, girl, sorry. You know how to get around. You, you must be doing this. You must have been doing this for a while. It's a true fact. Um, I have learned to adapt and to maneuver and get from point A to point B. Um, and yeah, I am starting to get my stuff together, um, except for my favorite flip-flop Crocs, my black Crocs that fit so well. And my sister even asked me where I got my, mm, some name, I'll have to remember it and put it in there. When she saw my Crocs, she thought those were those expensive. Uh, other kind of flip floppy things that the nurses wear a lot. Um, they make they make sneakers too, but let me tell y'all, my Crocs were very special to me, and I cannot locate them. They are not in any of that stuff whatsoever. I know that when I was in the overflow, a lot of you were asking me. What in the world? Where are you? Um, I was in the overflow ER area um, when I first came in, when they learned that I had hypogamma globulinemia. Look at me. I'm getting up. <gasps> I'm walking. I'm moving. When they found out, they put me in this room. Um, I say room, it was this big overflow area where um, they had started construction on a new area for radiology and they did not get to complete that for radiology because of we know who, Rona came on the, the Cena. Yeah, and so whenever I was secluded in that area, I'm opening closets over here, you guys. I'm still trying to find my, my uh, Crocs, but there was no pillows available down there in the ER area, and I was just like freaking out because I, you know me and my fibromyalgia, I needed pillows, and the only pillow I had to my name was my sweet zebra thingy right here. This was it. But I came finally to this lovely room, which I am saying is my color. Absolutely beautiful. And um, mm -hmm. I was going to hang up some of my stuff in this closet. And um, what in the world? Uh, okay, I feel like the princess and the pea up in here, y'all. You see that? <laughs> Seriously, literally. Where have all the pillows gone? Long time asking. Where have all the pillows gone? Long time ago, I can't find a pillow. Oh, no one's looking. Where did all the pillows go? Oh, I think I know. They're in my room at 555 on the fifth floor. I don't know how many pillows are there, guys, but that was the song that I wrote or made up or used the tune to. Mm. Anybody's looking for pillows downstairs in the ER? They're upstairs in my room. And no, I didn't bring them up here, but I did 
I did manage to uh, get about three or four of them in pillow slips, nice and sanitized, so that I could, <laughs> so I could have a, you know, a comfy place to sleep after dealing with the uncomfy <laughs> for 24 hours or something. this place they've been really good to me oh yeah shout out to these people let's see we've got Ashley Kim and Lene and Devin oh yeah Devin or Devon I can't I don't know how to say it but there it is those sweet people yeah and they want you to decide which face you know anywho <laughs> my face is happy right now I'm moving around. I'm able to do it without pain. I am totally, totally excited. If you excuse me, I've got to come over here and get this because, you know, my allergies still like to give me uh, grief. I'm getting my stuff together because today is the going home day. <laughs> and I have been just ecstatic. I had my breakfast and now I'm just waiting until I can G.O. Oh, sorry, sorry, sorry. I'm just waiting so I can get out of this joint, you all. Well, and you know, they, they bring you all these things. This is great. A little toothbrush for, you know, packing to go places or if you are dealing with um, needing to clean your jewelry or something, you know. <laughs> yeah, so that's what's happening. Don't want to keep you very long. I just want to make sure that everything is in my bag. Minus my Crocs, maybe they'll show up in Lost and Found, but with, um, with you know, that other person that came into town, what's her name, Delta? Yeah, honey, you know what? I'm not sure I want to search the Lost and Found for them Crocs. I might just have to leave them here. You know, you, you know. You just might have to do what you got to do, y'all. Thinking about it, thinking about it, you just have to, have to be real careful. So, uh, on with the show. I am packing up. I am packing up. I'm so excited. You know what this stuff is? Um, silicone cream moisturizes and nourishes that body okay well so that's where we are right now I am gonna walk back over here and finish my little drink that I put together I am still weak I'm not um, yeah I'm ready <laughs> I'm ready to sit back down. That was a long time up, but um, I'm excited. Thank you all for sticking around, watching this little video. Mother Bays, my sweet mama, is with that, my sister Mary, and I'm just 
uh, thinking. <laughs> Whew, I just am taking a little <sighs> respite. And no, this wasn't a vacation, but it was a healing time for this old gut of mine, I'm telling you. Um, they have put me on some new meds uh, that is to help me with these kind of flare-ups when you have that <clears throat> horrible, irritating disease. Yeah. When they say those flare-ups come and go, well, they... They definitely come, and I'm glad this one's gone, and I am shaking this camera all to pieces. Taking a little sip of my drink. I mixed up my orange juice with my ginger ale, and that is fine tasting stuff. Caffeine free, sugar free. Except for the orange, 100% orange juice yeah but this, oh sorry guys okay I'm gonna pause this little video just wanted to say this right here is the most tender and juiciest meal that I've had and I did mix up a little bit of goodness in my sweet tea let me see if I can get the lid off so you can see what I'm having. It's sugar-free, don't panic. It is sugar-free, y'all. I know. I put some iced, uh, there's my iced tea with um, a couple little things of this. Oh my goodness. Half and half. That's what's in here. and. That's my drink for the day. And this right here, I'm telling you, you may think that we need a um, big piece of bread, but the carbs are all in here. Don't need any extra bread on the plate today. There is some peaches. But I told you guys, this is, it's getting ready to happen right now. I'm getting ready to put this in my mouth. I am packed and ready to go. Over here is my bag, okay? I told you that I would be leaving today and <laughs> it's happening. Thank, thank, thankful for all these sweet people. There's my view. And <laughs> how do you like my socks? My flip-flops never did show up. My Crocs, so I have to leave here barefooted. Mm. And there's one of those helicopters. God bless whoever is in it or whoever's going in it. And bless the pilots in Jesus' name. Amen. And of course, bless this food, Father, for the nourishment of my body. Amen. Um, and just let you guys go. I still have a little stiff neck here. Um, but I love you. <laughs> Next time you'll see me, I'll be in the yarnery, I hope. Crocheting. Because I didn't have any of that good stuff here with me. Did not. So, love y'all real big. Jesus loves you more. And he loves me. as much as he loves you. Just a great big love. And I'm the apple of his eye. You know it, so are you. Thanks for all the prayers. Thanks for all the love and uh, well wishes. Love you.